hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today i don't really know what we're doing but obviously you can see by the title trying out some aussie oil smoothing it's for um frizzy and wavy hair make sure you put it on when it's wet obviously you can tell i've just got out the shower so obviously gonna be perfect for me so i think no more than two pumps because i think your hair's gonna go really greasy so let's see what it's what it's like oh it's like really oily Ugh. Ugh. i think i need two pumps because it's not really like a like a um like it's like very very oily so yeah <laughs> yeah i don't really know how to describe it but i did get it from home bargain so if you want to try it out then go to home bargain to get it it is aussie or if you do have aussie shampoo or whatever you get your aussie from it's probably there so yeah so first i just thought let's put on a tiny bit of makeup so i'm going to start off with my eyebrows so i'm going to be showing you how to do my eyebrows so first i'm just going to brush them down and try to get your full eyebrow down don't worry if it done and then hopefully you can see it's like a slow like a slant I was going to say like a slunted, but um, I meant slanted instead of slunted. So then, you're just going to get it from brush down. going to curve it up like that. And then it's kind of like flat on the side. So. There, and then you're going to get the top bit and then brush that bit down. I'm showing you because in case you want to do eyebrows. And then all you're going to do is bunk it up like that hold it and give it a really right brush up don't worry if it don't work out like that and then just kind of do it like that i am ambidextrous that means where you can do stuff with your left and your right hand so my eyebrows are done that one's done let's do this one you're just gonna curve it down from the top going like that and then you're just gonna go from there and then just blend that bit in and just kind of i don't know sort it out and there you've got your eyebrows so yeah so next we're gonna do mascara today i feel like we need to do mascara if i'm almost took my mascara back to her drawer i'm going to go mental i literally am going to go mental she am okay mom if you're watching this thank you i have to keep going and going and going okay so first you're going to curl your eyelashes And then you're gonna get it, and then you're just gonna go like that. People think I'm not ambidextrous, but like you said, like you said, like if you was like watching before, you'd obviously see I had to change it to do my left eyebrow in my left hand because I couldn't focus in my right. And obviously, if you're right handed, then you do stuff with your right hand unless you need to do stuff with your left. So. A fact you learn about me so next you don't need to put on too much is your concealer concealer does the job for me don't worry if you've gone wrong on your eyebrow I did it with mascara because my mum did it and then I and then I found out she only did it when mascara ends out so then my eyebrows went black and then and then I was going to my dad and my dad noticed so obviously it's gone really pale on me because I've obviously been in the sun because it's been sunny where I live in my country so yeah so like you know I on my little most viewed video that was last to leave the bath thank you so much for 200
200 views. 200 guys. I know it's not a big deal for you. Big deal for the YouTubers what you watch. But, you know, it's a big deal for me. So, yeah. So now you're just going to dip it back in. Do it now. It's obviously really light on me. And when I did that to my eyebrows, I put some concealer over. And then when I put it on, it turned my eyebrow white. So I need to put some contour over it. So, yeah, that's concealer. My mum's like, what does concealer do? And I'm like, stop wearing it instead of foundation. But my mum, when she had me, it was pigment pigmentation i gave a pigmentation if you don't know what pigmentation is it's basically where it gives you like spots like brown spots on your head like your forehead all over your face but my mum's not got it bad but my friend's mum she's got it bad bad i just paid like hundreds and hundreds of pounds to get rid of it and nothing's worked so it's like stains you for life so obviously you can tell it's like brown on my forehead than it is there. It is really light in person than it is on camera. And by the way, when you're watching this, the camera light kind of flips around. So it is in my left hand right now and not in my right. So, yeah. So now, we're going to do some contour because it's... gonna get my bamboo ones like I think pandas are my favorite things and I don't want them to be extinct like I know bamboo is a lovely thing but why do you want pandas to be extinct like really they're so cute literally why am I not using the dark one when it's too light oh my god you're you're dumb you're dumb you're so dumb so it has gone a little bit red, as you can see, but it's fine. I'm just going to get the brown bit there. I'm just going to blend it in. I'm going to turn like Sebastian Bales. I'm literally going to turn like Sebastian Bales. So now I'm all blended in on that side. Like, this is a number one thing that I recommend to. If something goes wrong with your thing, always get it. You know, just put it over and it sorts it out. Like, obviously, you'll have different colour skin to me. You know, obviously you will. So, because you have different colour skin to me, obviously, you'll have different palettes to me. You'll have different stuff to me. If you have the same colour skin as me, then you'll have the same palette as me. So, you know, everything works. But, like, people who are bad, bad at makeup. Like, when people are going to the worst, re worst reviewed makeup thing, like, like, kids like me can even do makeup better than that. It's just like, why are you being a beauty artist? When you're the worst rated like thing, you will just stop your shopping and just move on with your life until you get a good sh like good place and actually like do your course. You know, you would actually like do your course. I just need to add a little bit of that to that side of my face because that's like darker than the other. So yeah. That is gone like so orange. Mm. I'm turning. I'm turning. Mm. I just like doing that. I just really do. Like, look how dark that is. Like, oh my god, I need so much of that. Like, that is a concealer thing. That is a concealer problem.
So now that is like the same. I just need to blend. Blend, blend, blend. Blend. Oh my god. Now that's the same. Right, so now I'm just gonna put on a tiny, baby, baby, squeaky bit of foundation. Only, only because I have too much. Because my cheeks are really red and I just wanna go natural. So, and I've got way too much on here right now. And my dad's coming and picking me up because I'm currently at my mum's. And like, I've just been on the phone to him, and I've got like 10 minutes, and this video will be like 11 minutes, so I'm going to be like in trouble, but it's okay. But my dad's not strict, so I'm good. So I'll just go over it a little bit. Like makeup is my Like when it's the uniform day at school, I like put on a tiny bit of makeup. It's just like I don't care if you're gonna say anything to me. Just like keep it to yourself. I don't care what you think. You know what I mean? I don't care. I actually don't care what you think. Some of you might think I work fake tan. I don't know if you actually do. I'm just assuming you do with how orange my forehead is. No, I do not wait fake tan. I'm not gonna say how old I am, but I do not wait fake tan. I am too young. Yeah, I do not wear fake tan. I am not as white on camera, I promise you. Now I need some bronzer because this is wrong. I've done it for the wrong. Oh, my mum's done my bronzer. Sugar, my mum's done my bronzer. My mum's here. My mum's back. She's like, why are you putting on makeup? That's what my mum will be like. My mum's only been like five minutes. 